How you doing? It's uh, Paul from uh, May NPM Roofing, and uh, yep, I'm up here, up here on the roof here, and it's raining out. Uh, so this is a chimney which uh, the homeowner called. It was leaking. It had bad flashing, so we went ahead and pulled up all these shingles. We did ice and water shield on the deck, and then up the chimney, and then we've got new lead. And uh, we got a call from them this morning saying that the, the chimney chimney's still leaking so you know looking at it you've got uh, you've got a ton of bad mortar joints cracks uh, cracks in the bricks probably porous bricks you've got uh, porous you need a new mortar wash here they tried to patch that up so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this heavy duty saran wrap here I'm gonna wrap it around the chimney and uh, hi and uh, I'm making a video and uh, we'll uh, we'll see if this stops to leak. Pretty sure it will. Hey, it's Paul from AMPM Roofing. So I just wrapped this chimney up with uh, the saran wrap here. It's all the way down to the lead. Coming up top, we get most of the water away from coming through this uh, this uh, mortar wash here. Um, there's still some spots where you just can't get too tight, but I mean that's. I'm pretty sure that's gonna uh, that's gonna keep most of the 90% of the water out. So if it leaks from here. If it doesn't leak, then it's the chimney. Uh, if it leaks, then we've got an issue with uh, with the shingles. But you know, under underneath here, I've got pictures of all ice and water shield going all the way around. You know, we did a good job. Went all the way up here. So my guess is it's got to be coming through that through that brick there. From AM PM roofing. So um so I'm inside. We're we're looking at the chimney right now. Or next to the chimney. Right here is where a lot of the water was, was coming in. And you can see that there's no shiny water molecules building up here anywhere. This is uh completely dry. Um we're gonna let it rain for a while as we've got some snow, some snow coming tonight. Oh boy. And then got a lot of water coming down through here. Got a towel wedged up in there and that right now there is zero water entering through the chimney. So it has to be I mean so far, knock on wood, it's has to be all porous brick and bad mortar joint related. And if you look here See, that's a good indication that, yeah, you've... How you doing, everybody? It's Paul from AM PM Roofing. Uh, so I'm back here on the uh, the saran wrap chimney in Clinton. So the homeowner, Mr. Gary, liked the job that we did so much that uh, it stopped the leak. So as an extra precaution, he wanted me to put another triple layer of this saran wrap around his chimney to make it to, uh, through to the spring. So I'll show you what I did here. We actually took off that other flue because he's not using it. I put a three shingles and then I wrapped saran wrap around that to get the, give this top pretty much a complete cover up here. Uh, the only opening is around this uh, this little gas uh, gas liner uh, cover here. And uh, but still, it's pretty tight. I mean, I'm I'm pretty confident that we got. 99% of the water is not going to be coming in from the top. 100% of the water is not going to be coming in from the bottom. That's where I tied off there. You see it's right above the, the chimney flashing over here. Which is ideal. This is going to prove that, you know, we're supposed to have some heavy rains on um, Saturday. And uh, Gary's going to have a, another look at it just to make sure. But uh, the day after it came here and the rain and, and, uh, and then it snowed later on. Um... It, it uh, he checked it in the attic and it solved the problem. He had zero water coming in, but again, he's gonna, he's gonna there he's, 